pretty excited with the, with the bronze medal, even if you didn't pull off today. It means a lot for you at this time, Charlie. Yeah, sure. I'm, uh, maybe it sounds a bit weird, but uh, personally to me it feels a bit like a victory. I'm, uh, I'm really happy with it. I mean, on this uh, completely flat course, um, I think the, the powers that uh, Wout and, and Filippo push yeah, it's not. Uh, I cannot compare myself with them, but uh, I think I did a really good TT. Uh, from start to the finish, I actually pushed quite the same powers. I could speed up a little bit in the final, so uh, yeah, I got nothing to to be mad of for today. So uh, third place, that feels a bit like a victory. Yeah. You had a lot of time in that hot seat, and you could watch the battle between your teammate and Filippo Ghana. What did you see, and how nail biting was that finish? Seeing Ghana just. 5.3 seconds faster than your teammate. Yeah, um, at the the second time split, I was I mean, it was one second. So uh, there you knew it could go in every situation to the finish line. But uh, yeah, I think uh, Filippo maybe was just a little bit more fresh to, towards the final. Um, yeah, six seconds on this course is like is the same speed. You know, it's uh, there is almost no difference. So uh, yeah was actually an amazing battle between those two guys and then I was also hoping for myself <laughs> to be on that podium and uh, I also uh, kept it with a small march, I mean three seconds or something on Kasper, my teammate, so uh, yeah, I'm really happy, uh, but it was, like you said, a really long time in that hot seat. Yeah, exactly, I think uh, the whole Belgian team is in a good shape, everything is, uh, everybody is quite confident, but uh, if you see all the other nations, they are also in a very good shape. So uh, it's going to be an exciting race, I guess. Really long, and uh, yeah, I think uh, towards the final it will get harder and harder. And I think uh, that's going to be the most exciting part of the race. Thank you.